I would like to talk a bit on bandwagon effect. The bandwagon effect is a phenomenon whereby we tend to adopt the beliefs and opinions of the majority. As more people come to believe in something, others also hop on the bandwagon, regardless of the underlying evidence. According to this concept, the increasing popularity of the product or a phenomenon encourages more people to get onto the bandwagon too. The bandwagon effect explains why there are fashion trends and why some people vote for those candidates or parties who are likely to succeed or are proclaimed as such by the media, hoping to be on the winner's side in the end. We are also dramatically affected by the people around us. If we are around people who read a lot, it simulates us to read more. If we are around people who are politically aware, it urges us to pay more attention to the political events and trends. If we are around who eat a balanced diet and exercise regularly, we are more apt to live a healthy lifestyle. That's the reason we tend to go to a doctor which is crowded with more patients than the one who is not. I had gone to meet my friend once who is a doctor. There was a board outside saying, please leave your shoes outside. So I did that and went to meet him. I thought he was very keen on keeping his workplace clean. But when I saw him, he was wearing the shoes. So I asked him the reason for asking others to leave his shoes outside while he himself was not following the rule. The answer he gave was very interesting. He said that there is one more doctor practicing next to his dispensary. So when people see lots of shoes outside my dispensary but none outside his, people get wary about why there is no patient going to the other doctor and they visit me instead. Now that was a wicked one. But it works. So I thought, how do we apply that to our business? So after brainstorming on why I purchased from someone, I found that many of my decisions were based on the three facts. Number one is testimonials or case studies. People after reading it will join because they think someone has got a result in that product which I might lose. Include your success stories or your in your blogs, on your Facebook post on webinar and even your thank you page on the opt-in. Number two is attaching yourself to a highly valued person. So when you say I have been coached by MLM superhero rather than someone new in that industry, your credibility increases. Number three is endorsement. Endorsement from previous client or even from peers in your industry. So usually you see the first few pages of the book or a movie reviews is filled with endorsement. LinkedIn is a better place to get your endorsement. We'll end this video with a quote, a simple formula for a happy life is never try to defeat anyone, just try to win everyone. Do like or share this video if you have got some value out of it. This is Sanjay Rao here, signing off. Have a great day.